Hey, 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 Scorpio, this is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your reading. So this is going to be a reading for my Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Scorpio, if you would before you leave. I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs, information can be found in the description box below. Make sure that you're utilizing that link as there are scammers about the community. And know that you will always see my face in a reading as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. Don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. All right. So you have for your overall energy, Scorpio, the heart of cups. You have the high priestess as your challenge. You have the Four of Pentacles, the Nine of Swords, and the Four of Swords. Hmm. Expression of the heart here with the Heart of Cups. I feel like, Scorpio, you're, you're starting small, but for some reason this is making you anxious and fearful. Vulnerability, which seems to be coming up a lot today. So it could be because you're holding on to something, right? You're not in alignment here. This is causing anxiety and fear. So you may be going within. Yeah, so Spirit of Swords, there is, um, there are messages coming in. Yeah, this is due to a past trauma in love, past um, depression regarding a past love. So you're trying to express your heart, but it's making you nervous. Yeah, see? Strength. Okay? So you're really needing strength to express your heart. You're trying to find the strength because of this past hurt. You've got to be careful that you're not containing all this energy and it's not being expressed. Okay? Because it's going to cause health issues. I mean... Yeah. Okay. So you're getting a love message here. This is why you are choosing to express your heart here, okay? Tell me about the High Priestess. What is the High Priestess? The Heart of Pentacles. Wow. This is your challenge. And I feel like this is about balance because what I'm getting is you've got the Pentacles over here. You've got the Swords. You've got the Cups. And I feel like, like I said, you're starting small, you're expressing your heart, but along the way, you're trying to balance all of the elements, right? Earth, fire, air, and water. The only thing missing here is fire, is passion. So it's going to be a challenge too. Here we go. Five of wands. It's going to be a challenge to listen to your intuition here. Maybe even a challenge to keep something secret, Scorpio. It could be a love, ten of swords, nine of wands. Wow. Hmm. Accepting an ending, right? There's. It's going to be a challenge, Scorpio, for you to get through some internal conflict regarding this Five of Cups energy because it. I feel like, I feel like it's already ended, but if it hasn't, it will. Uh, there's a lot of guardedness here, okay? So you really got to make sure that you're working through this so that, yeah, see, despair. You've got to keep going with the energy and continue on. Tell me about the Four of Wands. I'm oh, sorry, the Four of Pentacles. So we have the Tower. So you're holding on to a huge tower moment. Sky Father. Wow. So the Emperor here. All right, I'm getting control. Jenna Jackson's control. 
and the three of swords so you could be healing over somebody that was very controlling here with the three of swords or you were one of the other or you felt like you were right Mm, poverty so a lack mentality here yeah I feel like this is like walking on eggshells this is what you're healing over but I, I also feel it's codependent so it's very difficult for you to to not only believe it's ended just accept to move on but I do feel you will because your overall energy is what is that the heart of cups and the spirit of swords. So expression of your heart. Tell me about the nine of swords. Ace of cups. Oh, wow. So you're in the middle. You're going to be in the middle of it, of getting through an ending. And in the middle of all this, you're getting a love offer. And that is could also be something that's surprising to you, the Ten of Pentacles, and it's going to be somebody who wants to commit pretty freaking quickly. Six of Swords. But you're not going to be able to until you find this peace because right now you're in these turbulent waters. Okay? Okay. Community. Okay, so pay attention to the people around you and the support that they can give you. So we have the chariots, clarifying the four of swords, the ten of wands, and the ace of wands, and the three of pentacles. Wow. So yeah, I feel like through inner reflection and really meditation, you're going to be able to push forward, move forward, right, in a very passionate way. Here's that fire. So you have the ten of wands here. It's going to be... You're going to feel like it's work. It is, but it's internal work. And it's going to help you transform and really move forward and connect to that divinity within you. So, advice. Three of Wands. The Empress, which is Earth Mother. And the two of cups so this is what you've been waiting for so this could be Taurus or Libra for you okay masculine or feminine this is just somebody in their feminine energy right very the Empress whatever they touch turns to gold male or female so it's it's very fruitful right this is love but you're gonna have to accept your past and accept that it's ended and Yep. Or you're you're stealing your happiness with thief here. It's like you're snatching it away if you don't, you know, challenge yourself to, to get over letting something go. Okay. Um wait a minute. Shit. Hang on one minute. Okay. So let's see, let's get an advice card for you, Scorpio, and see what's up. What's your advice for this spread? Cleanse. So you have cleanse. Your body, mind, and soul are urging you to take the time out for some much-needed cleansing. Just as you wash your car, clean the house, or tidy your office, your body also needs care and attention. It's time for some spiritual, emotional, and physical cleansing. All right, Scorpio, I hope that resonates. Please drop a like below, share, and subscribe if you already have it. If you're interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs. Information can be found in the description box below. Make sure that you're utilizing the link in the description box as there are scammers about the community and know that you will always see my face in a reading that um if you order one from me so you have a good one and i will catch you on the flip side on the dailies namaste